Hi, I'm Joseph Valente and I'm the Managing Director of Impregas Limited. So in my background is in plumbing and heating. I started my first apprenticeship when I was 16 and I progressed throughout the industry and I'm now a business owner and I've currently been running Impregas for the last three years. I started my first plumbing and heating apprenticeship when I was 16. I progressed throughout Peterborough Regional College. I then went on to do an apprenticeship in gas works and I became a qualified gas engineer when I was 19. That allowed me to then progressed my career throughout the plumbing and heating industry and at the age of 22 I started Impregas Limited. My apprenticeship was a vital part of my success. Without my apprenticeship I would never have been able to become a qualified plumbing and heating engineer. I never would have gained the skills that allowed me to further my career to become a gas engineer and then further my career even more to start a business. Recently I became the winner of The Apprentice 2015 and I've now become Lord Sugar's business partner. This is a great platform for Impregas Limited and all of the people that are associated with the business. It's going to allow us to accelerate our growth and become a nationwide plumbing and heating business. I think it's very important for not only myself at Impregas Limited but for also other business owners to take on apprentices. They are the backbone of small businesses and they allow the business to flourish. My greatest advice to any apprentice out there is to persevere. Unfortunately, you are on a lower wage at this point in time, but once you get qualified, you will progress and the money will become a lot better. You just have to see the future. Don't look at it as short term, but look at the long term goals. I persevered for two years, not getting paid the best money when a lot of my friends were getting paid better but I always knew that it was going to pay off and it did pay off and I advise anybody to make sure that you stay on track with your apprenticeship. I think there are pros and cons between apprenticeships and going to university. The great things that apprenticeships can offer is workplace experience. You get to learn the job and you learn the job a lot quicker and another major benefit is the employer that you do your apprenticeship with, nine times out of ten will, you offer, you, will offer you a full-time job at the end of your apprenticeship where a lot of people that go to uni get qualified and then they struggle to gain employment. So when you leave uni you're not guaranteed employment and you do have an accumulated rise in debt but with an apprenticeship you're paid from day one and you come out of it with a qualification and nine times out of ten an employment position. Hi there guys, if you enjoyed watching that then check out our other videos we have to offer. Things such as case studies, hints and tips and tutorial videos. Also, why not keep up to date with all that 3A have to offer by hitting that subscribe button.